what's good what's good what's good lovely soul empress here coming to do the weekly energy check from i forgot the date from the 17th to the 23rd okay so i did your pre-shuffle and you didn't get a lot of cards you got the mother of baskets so you could be feeling this is the uh queen of cups in this deck um, you could be in an emotional state right now or somebody sees you as very loving and nurturing, okay? You got the eight of knives, okay? You could be stuck in your head about a situation that has to do with the two of cups, okay? Soulmate energy, this could be, you know, friend, family, lover, right? Uh, feels like there's a judgment that's needing to take place, some type of final decision, okay? There's change on the way this week, Okay. And then you have keep an open mind, which is, uh, you know, uh, your soulmate may differ from your usual type and trust. Okay. I feel like, um, there's a need to trust in the divine, even if you're not trusting in, you know, uh, people around you. Okay. You got the ancient power of mysteries here, the rattle of ISIS playing. And I feel like this is the energy of you feeling something about to come in. Okay. Something to be revealed or something that is about to happen you also got the syrians here and it says artistic integrity and honesty and i feel like these are qualities that you have spirits telling you whatever happens this week make sure that you stay in that energy okay then uh you also got alpha draconians corrupt unethical and cults so there could be somebody around you who's acting unethical okay or spiritually unethical and there is a need to be cautious okay you also got crop circles okay and it says messages curiosity and signs i feel like that um the isis rattle and the crop circles is telling you pay attention to the signs they're all around you okay we're gonna pull a seven card spread one for each day spirit can you give me one for the 17th please one card one card for the 17th please and one card for tuesday please one card for wednesday one card for wednesday please one card for thursday please one card for friday please one card for saturday please and one card for sunday thank you sorry my nose itches all right you got the ace coins at the bottom of the deck so there's definitely a seed i feel like you're feeling pretty abundant or you're gonna be all right uh this has to do with um a decision though judgment again and the ace of cups underneath that okay with the daughter of coins this is the knight of wands no knight of of um pentacles I feel like you've been waiting on something um, and it's taking too long. Five of coins, you could have felt left out in the cold. I feel like you're deciding to go in a new direction in some way, okay? Now you've got here the six of knives. Spirit, why is the six of knives here? So you're trying to move to calmer waters and you're, um, you know, building a plan with the seven of pentacles, okay? You could be considering moving or um, changing careers. Two of Pentacles, all right. I feel like you've been you have a lot on your plate to make this happen. Okay, the Two of uh, Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles is the Nine of Pentacles. There could be the energy of you feeling like you're doing everything alone, but this is something that you have to do to go to calmer waters. Now you got the Seven of Baskets here. This is the Seven of Cups. It could be some type of illusions or choices. With the Eight of Pentacles, all right, there might be some unclarity about what's going on. It's not the Eight of Pentacles, my sorry. My era, Page of Pentacles, not the Eight of Pentacles. Um, this could be you trying to take a course or study something, right? This also could be a purchase. It could be a major purchase. With that Ace of Pentacles, you could be buying a home or you could be trying to figure out how, you know, to advance in your career in some way. You got the uh, the Nine of Pentacles here. 
Okay, I just spoke about the Nine of Pentacles, okay? And the Ace of Cups. So this is something that's very important to you, although there may be some illusions or uh, unclarity around you. Okay, now for Wednesday, you have the Eight of Sticks with the Nine of Sticks, okay? So I feel like some type of burden is building, okay? What's this Eight of Sticks? It's communication, spirit. Why? Why is this Eight of Sticks here? So somebody could be trying to communicate with you, okay? Page of Cups in reverse, but they're not apologizing or they're not taking responsibility. Six of Pentacles is crossed here. They don't give equally to the situation. I feel like you're tired of that, okay? This Nine of Sticks, which is also in the same position for Wednesday. I feel like you're trying to resist something or somebody's telling you they want to still fight for something. Why is this Nine of Sticks here, please? With the devil cross, okay? Somebody's telling you, you know, why can't we make this work? You know, things aren't as bad as they seem, or you could be saying that to somebody, all right? Now, on Thursday, you have the eight of knives, spirit, why? You feel at a crossroads, okay? You might feel stuck in a situation, okay? There could be some words exchanged with this knight of swords, okay? Hierophant is here in reverse. This could be about a lack of commitment, okay? There could be a Taurus involved in this situation. I feel like there's some type of lack of commitment or lack of stability, lack of structure, okay? And then on Friday, you have here the three of baskets with the ten of sticks. Spirit, why is this three of baskets here? Three of baskets with the seven of cups, okay? There's some type of illusion about a happiness or an event or a third party, okay? You also have the eight of pentacles. Somebody's telling you they want to work on something, all right? The sun is here. This could have something to do with their ego or they want to be happy, but there's some type of illumination here with the two of swords, Something, you know, you could be at an event and something seems confusing. This is a Friday, right? Eight of Pentacles. This could be an offer to work with somebody or to collaborate in some way, all right? And you could notice something that you didn't see before with this Two of Swords. Now you have the Ten of Wands here. Spirit, why? I feel like whatever you... Whatever is illuminated to you that you couldn't see before gives you some type of clarity about these burdens, about the chariot, about how you want to pull away from something or why somebody pulled away. Four of Cups. Spirit, why? For, for Saturday, you might feel like it's a missed opportunity or you want to miss an opportunity or somebody could feel like that about you. But the Seven of Wands is here. It's like you're putting up your healthy defenses, even though you might feel like you wanted it to go another way. Spirit, can I get one more? The Moon in Reverse. There's some clarity. Something's come out with these messages, crop circles, all right? Something happens maybe at an event where you get clarity about something and something that was hidden before is no longer hidden. Sunday is the six of sticks. Okay, let's talk about tension and victory. Spirit, why? The high priestess and the emperor. Let me get one more. One more, spirit. With the Knight of Cups. So somebody's going to, this emperor is going to come in and offer you a, a cup of love, okay? Um, I feel like you're the high priestess here. I feel like you get victory by pulling your energy back or being silent and observing something. Six of Swords, okay? Just where you started is like what's at the bottom of the deck, okay? Six of Swords. Ten of Cups. King of Cups. Temperance. Will of Fortune, Okay, so I feel like they, this person wants to reconcile something with you 
or this uh, this could be a business partner okay but i feel like something is gonna be coming the upright okay now you might resist this with this death card here okay nine of wands you may feel like you've had enough or you might feel like this person is sneaky in some way okay or you're trying to manifest something greater and you could be passing on this situation with this two of wands but i feel like even if you do that the eight of wands you get messages from this person they're still waiting for you the ace of pentacles king of wands they still end up taking action towards you so i feel like this is not the end of the story for that okay oh spirit is there anything else we need to know about this situation for the week of the 17th to the 23rd spirit anything else Wealthy man, pathway, and family room. Bottom of the deck is coffin. Okay, somebody could have been uh, doing something maybe financially that wasn't fair, maybe with the two of pentacles and the six of pentacles cross. There could have been some energy of you carrying more of the weight of something, all right? Wealthy uh, man. Let me get another deck to clarify this. Yeah, this one. Wealthy man, spirit. curious about you there could be somebody that is uh observing you uh how you handle conflict or responsibilities okay photo proof getting evidence i'm hearing i always feel like somebody's watching me right pathway and ego I told you there was something here about the Ten of Wands and you pulling back some energy. Something about somebody choosing to do something that wasn't structured. Something that is illuminated to you, maybe at an event. Okay, you could be realizing that somebody was uh, doing less. Let's say this is at work, that somebody could be taking advantage of you um, so that you can carry most of the load. You did have that draconian, cult-like, um, corrupt, right? Family ain't shit wants you back. Okay, so like I said, you could be involved with this person intimately, right? Or maybe, you know, they come around your house or you work from home, right? Right? But I feel like this person, they were taking advantage of you in some way. And it feels like you figure it out, okay? Uh, you may feel like this person stops you from going to common waters. Like they're a burden, okay? Facts, no facts, make shit up. They also feel dishonest, okay? This person could be a player, all right? Let's see what you should be working on for the week. Spirit, can you show me? Can you show me, Spirit? Okay, empathy is crossed, okay? I feel like this person may have taken advantage of you when you were, you know, uh, needing assistance and you might feel like they were not empathetic to your situation. You also have change here. I feel like you're about to change this around, okay? Spirit. Very soon came out, okay? Anything else? Thank you. Finances and career. I feel like, you know, this is about some type of financial situation. You got very soon. Love yourself first. Okay. Which I feel like is what you're getting ready to do. Okay. You got true love. I feel like this person really does have feelings for you, but maybe they are a person that moves in a way where they take advantage if they can get somebody else to do the work narcissist let's just let's call it what it is okay so this person could be a type of person that tries to manipulate other people to have more responsibilities okay keep an open mind all right you may be trying to look for some other type of love i really do feel like this person does have emotions for you though okay let's see um let's clarify these real quick very soon spirit very soon you are my person. I communicate through music. And what the hell? They never thought you would pull your energy back. Love yourself first. 
our separation still affects me okay so you could be separating from this person i am full of pain okay and get your shit and get out i feel like this is what you're telling to this person whether you lived with them or not it's just like you you feel like this person is taking advantage in some way okay true love you are my destiny staying away from you is the hardest thing i ever had to do okay and keep an open mind spirit why I should have been more honest with you, okay? And this is truthful, okay? So now they're trying to see things from another light. You may not feel like that. I need you and your pure love too, okay? So I feel like this is what's happening. I know who you are to me. So this person is going to try to come back in. You may not go for that, okay? Because you might feel like they took advantage, okay? I'm hearing, I can't go for that, can't go for that can't go for that all right so that's what i have for you guys i just like to say thank you to my returning subscribers for coming through and spending a little time with me and if you're a new viewer and you felt that resonated with you please like subscribe and comment as i love to have you as part of the lovely soul family i'm wishing y'all light and love and blessings on blessings namaste